Hello and welcome back to Dead Space. Let's play Dead Space again. Part 13? Maybe? Possibly? 14 maybe? I don't know. So this is refrigeration. Um, I mean it looks cold. It seems to be cold. There's a lot of floating limbs. But I don't see anything being refrigerated here. It's just a lot of spikes. So, you know, it's not my idea of refrigeration. I don't even think I finished my thought, or my thing. Oh, oh yeah, enemies. Uh, yeah, they're... this game is enemies. How can I forget? I'm not jumping in there. I have no health, and I do not intend to use it. Oh my god. No. You see, when I shoot you, I want you to die. Thanks. I don't think I actually finished my, uh thought on Dead Space, not Dead Space, uh, the Exploders. Where are these things? I, the zero gravity is so really, really disorienting. I don't think I actually finished my thought on the Exploders. Um, I think I left off and they don't deal much, they deal less damage than you think in Dead Space 1, especially considering it's an explosion. But in Dead Space 2, like, on Zealot difficulty, which is the hardest difficulty, I don't think the Exploders can really do anything but insta-kill you. Also, their explosion radius is like twice as long. Uh, see, it always comes down to this for Dead Space 1. The zero gravity sections are super disorienting in Dead Space 1. I'm kind of sitting all right-ish on all ammo. That's nice. The zero gravity stuff is... Oh... This... I am playing a really dangerous game right now. So I'm on red health. Um, Isaac doesn't have an animation change in when he's in zero gravity, but he does whenever he's out. Look at him. Barely standing up. I'm still dedicated to uh, upgrading my health. The cheap. Look at that walk. That is a man who is barely hanging on. Earth filtration room. Oh god. You know what? I kind of want to. Can you give me a small med pack, please? Those are credits. That doesn't help me. Oh, let's cross again. Thank God. This is Dr. Cross in hydroponics. I'm trying to locate second engineer Jacob Temple. I'll use a medium. I can't get through to engineering. Of course I know there's a shipwide medical alert. That's why I'm trying to locate him. No, we're safe for now, but the tram is down and we can't reach the escape pod. Hello? Hello? I don't get that. Cause she didn't die. Spoiler, she shows up. So this is a... This is a part. So basically you have to run between these huge jets of fire, but the middle one doesn't work, so it's safe in there. And believe it or not, there are enemies in here that just straight ignore that. I have no idea where the other enemies are. They might be through this door. Nope, he's here. He's here with me. Oh my god, that was an insta kill? That's amazing. Hold map for going in there. See? They're completely unaffected. Even though it's a giant torrent of fire. It's not really a torrent, is it? I don't even know if that's the right word. Although, we found the last one of these. By the way, there's four in each side. From the starting room, there's four to the left, four to the right. That's the fourth one. I'm pretty sure we get attacked by an enhanced, maybe. Now let's leave. I'm, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna wait for him. Oh, by the way, we should probably start saving up credits because we do get another suit soon. Those are generally what you want to save for. 
Although I think I know the price of it. And I think we've actually got a lot over it. Because we have 10,000 from that. Yeah, we'll easily hit it. Also, there's a power note in here. Again, I kind of question the design of these rooms, but I guess you're supposed to use this to pass through. But this looks like a security station, so I don't know. I don't design video games. To the grow chamber. Isn't that where the middle room is? I think it is, and I think there's enemies too. Let's look at our stuff. Decent amount of plasma ammo, good amount of line gun, good amount of force gun, contact beam, that is uh, 7,000 credits sitting there. I think the next suit of armor is like 35,000. Or I guess 3,500, if you're like, is that 3,500? That's 300, that's 350 hundred. No, so it's 3,500. It's 3, I don't get why Americans say, like, 50 hundred. Was it, like, they'll say 90 hundred instead of 9,000? I don't get that. Hello. Oh, God. Well, that's dead. Okay, I'm moving. Avoid it, avoid it, there are, oh, yep, there's this guy. Aim for the line gun. Be true. Don't hit the stomach. I don't think I've actually hit the stomach of any of those guys. I, I clipped something behind him. Now I'm pretty well, uh, decently well. I don't think we'll upgrade air. I don't think we need air. Although there is a part later in the game where you might need to use air. I think the most important... Sure. I think the most important thing for the weapon upgrades is... is, like, damage. <clears throat> like... Because damage lets you overall save ammo, although capacity and reload can be good. Sweet. Uh, I'm going to go get nodes before going back, because I don't think the other way actually has a bench. But I'm actually, now that I'm thinking about it, I think there is a node door. Anyway, uh, sell that ruby conductor. Uh... Sell that. Sell that. I want to keep these. I want to keep all this. I think I'll be good. But do I want the large med pack? Nope. Nope, nope. I'm going to sell it. Now, I think we'll be able to make the thir 3... Wow, I have a lot of DLC for this game. Why do I have the DLC for this game? The DLC for this game is... I think these do actually have some stat boosts, but they're f I can't buy them weirdly. Oh, that's because I have a full weapon inventory. These are... Th that... the scorpion suit is cheating. The scorpion suit is cheating. The scorpion suit is 60% damage reduction. I think we'll be able to make up enough credits. Yeah, I think we'll be able to make up enough credits by the time we get the next suit. Because I, the next suit isn't at the beginning of the level. The next suit is, like, somewhere in the middle. So, like, you can... You have a bit of free reign. You're the... No, you're not. Here's that bench. Although we can't spend one node because we have a node door. So let's upgrade our health to get all that back. That's good. Uh, let's go here. We could get more damage for that. Can't really get more damage for that. Should we get more damage for this? I don't really use it. Oh, I'll, I'll do that. Absolutely. The force gun actually has a very efficient tree. Like, you never have to go more than one without upgrading something. Unlike, say... 
guess you don't really have to do that with the plasma cutter either. I'll upgrade the damage of the plasma cutter, but I'll go towards capacity because I need to do that for damage. And give me that health. There it is. Six bars of health. And more damage and capacity. Although, was it more capacity for this thing? Yep. And I don't think we upgraded the capacity to anything else. Did for the force gun. You can upgrade the line gun to be wider than this, but I don't really know why. I don't, I don't feel like you need it to be wider than that. I think this is a text log. Yup. No doubt you're aware of the organic growth found in some parts of the ship. I've been examining the cells and thought results would interest you. The cells most closely resemble bacteria with viral behavior. Like bacteria, the organisms infect other cells through osmosis. Then mutate and reproduce, oh god, agmog agmogenetically. What amazing is the speed of which it grows. A single bacterium reproduces 20-fold in just one minute. I've never seen anything like it. I won't stake my reputation on it, but I think this may be a genuine alien life form. Professor Harley theorized that it's a habit habitat transformer. The level of gaseous outputs are tremendous, which is why it smells so bad. But to what end, we simply don't know. I'll keep you posted. So yeah, that's a thing. Also, that's a thing, isn't it? You, stay there. Now, immediately took a hit, but whatever. You didn't do what I wanted you to do. By the way, don't step on those. Oh god, I'm gonna have to fight this guy the right way. Stay there. So this is kind of what you're supposed to do. I think he's got one left, maybe? Yeah, that's the kind of like inefficient way. I don't know why that first one didn't kill it. Ooh, that took a hit on the resources. I guess we'll use the force gun for a bit. Good amount of, although we are about to get a bunch of supplies in here then. We got ammo, 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 large med pack. Good amount of credits. I think we picked up something else that I didn't see. I think it was just more ammo. So, like, that's good. Our, our supplies are back up. Yup, I remember that. I remember that. Die, please. Thanks. Not a decent amount of ammo and stuff. You know, for... I remember this chapter weirdly well, which is weird because I don't remember the bot. There is a bench in here. Well, or I just stupid. I don't remember the boss fight that well, though. Or at all. I think there's enemies up here, too. I guess not. I mean, have you looked at the ship computer? You might want to look at it. I remember this. Uh, remember that contact beam I have? I think it's about to see some use. Wink, wink. Because there's a brute. I'm pretty sure with this I can cheese him. So get him to charge and then run out of the way. Stasis him and then shoot his leg off. That didn't actually take his leg off. That annoys me. There we go. There we go. That's a leg on. Now we play catch him. There's actually an achievement in this game to uh, hit a brute with its own projectile. Or I think it's to kill a brute with its own projectile. So you kind of have to. I almost thought it just killed. Oh, it can move like that, though. Don't worry. It will, it'll try. 
It's dead. I wanted to drop a power node. Which is obscenely the same as a ruby semiconductor. I don't really know why they give you a ruby semiconductor. I guess if you want to use it on our stuff, but I mean, they're, they're worth the same. And I actually, I think there is one better than a ruby semiconductor. I think there's like something higher on the list. So where are these guys? There's one in here. Now ah, we're at 15 minutes and I don't see a save point. We'll keep going. We'll kill this guy before we, uh, we, we die. But I mean, you'd have to stand here for like 90 seconds doing nothing. It's just you suffocate. I kind of don't want to reload my contact beam because I could just upgrade it. And I've only fired one shot. And that's like the gun I would actually care about because it's so expensive ammo. Such expensive ammo. Get it right, me. Oh, he's a force gun again. Why not? Onwards to the next venture, which I think there's actually like three in this one area. Why are you... Is there not one in here? I guess there is an there. Oh my god, that scared me more than I, I wished it bit. Although... Oh, I guess that's because you have to fight a brute, and they want to make sure you have ammo. Yeah, if you don't do the whole shoot off its legs thing, you can spend up a, a lot of ammo on those. Although, uh, let's say that we're quite fine on resources. I could have swore that there was one more necromorph in this room. Oh, I think I know. Isn't it in here? Oh, it is. That. That is sneaky. But not sneaky enough. Although you do have to shoot this one. So I guess that's a thing. So, one, two. There we go. So now, where do you want me to go? Do you want me to go to floor two? I guess there is a way to find out by looking at the map. I think it actually wants me to go to floor three, but there's like... Okay, I'll, I'll take your word for it, game. I'll go to floor three. Man, this part's going on. Got a sort of shorter one, now we're getting a longer one. Why is this elevator so much quicker? Oh, that's why, because there's one up here. I forgot about that completely. Although I think there is a save point somewhere around here. There usually is. They don't make you go too far without save points. And that is three. And there is a fourth one somewhere. I think we gotta go to floor two. I'm just gonna trust my instincts to go to floor two. Anything? On the, uh, anything? I mean, there's stuff back here. Hydroponics log, Dr. Cross reporting. Something huge just slammed into the hole near food storage. It wasn't a rogue asteroid. I know what that sounds like. But it was big and heavy. I'll report again when I know more. So did the Leviathan... Didn't the Leviathan grow? By the way, I'd recommend you save... Uh, here's a save point. That's... That's good. I'll save now. I'd recommend you save ammo, though, because... I can't remember which boss it is, but I'm pretty sure that they're, like... Really beefy either way. Although, let's save now. Because there you go. And... That is the end of this part. 